might I'm, come out your motherfucking house right here. A nigga might be standing over the top of a nigga. Nah, you hear me? Really knocking his noodle off. Who is? Who? Nigga, we in the abandoned house found 70 bands. We ain't seen them for a year. I nuts a little bit. Who's that? Let's get it, man. It's big motion, motion gang. We have a heavy rotation tapped in with the real MVP TV. Yeah, man. we the ones put the paint where it ain't. When you come on the north side, tapping with the motion gang, man. We have a heavy rotation. Nah, for free. I know what's going on. We around 58, man. It's the first house, man. 518 59th Street. It's the first house I moved around here. 06. I was like 11 years old. Yeah, me. Me and my little family. You know what I'm saying? That's where it all started at. Yeah, me. I went to HD down the street. A nigga ain't had to take no bus and uh, for real, for real, for high school and shit. A lab when I moved around here, you hear me? Before I moved around here, I was living up Edgewood. Like shit cool up there, good vibes up there. But when I moved around here, it was a whole different ball game around that time, you hear me? Shit was really trenches. My first, I want to say like my first or second day living around here, my mother had some friends that lived right up the street up Clay Turris. A nigga just got smoked out here, you hear me? The day before we moved around here, so my mother kids, my mother friend kids and shit had us go up Clay Turrets one time and uh, that shit was y'all like super militant, like shit y'all like was, it was shit going on, you hear me, back then it was really shit going on, like you couldn't just be walking through everywhere, you'll get your ass jump, you'll get your ass, especially as young and you get your ass jump, it be shit going on, niggas beefing, woo woo woo, as a youngin, you hear me? And then when do you think it started like affecting you type shit? Started affecting me immediately, you hear me? Cause I had to figure out my way. When I moved out here, it was like, what I'ma do, you hear me? What I'ma do, I started pumping gas. I was like, 11 years old, I was pumping gas, trying to get some little money, just so I could, you know what I'm saying? Make Be the nigga I am, y'all like look sweet, shit like that, you hear me? Cause when I moved around here, I wasn't claiming around here. I was claiming Edgewood, you get what I'm saying? I was a younger, you hear me? That's all I knew was Edgewood. So when I got out here, of course it was, a, who you? What's up with you? Oh yeah, I'm from Edgewood. Oh yeah. We gotta check his temperature. Y'all like get all over him, you hear me? All in all, nigga stood tall through that shit, you hear me? Got through that shit. I wasn't going for none. I done went to plenty of schools, niggas trying to do what they do, you hear me? So what's it like trying to maneuver through DC type shit? Cause when we think of DC, you just think of White House, President, all the good shit. Nah, if you know, you know, you hear me? You gotta play them mirrors out here. You gotta y'all like really be on point, you hear me? You see, I can't even really look at the camera cause we outside, I gotta y'all like keep, you know what I'm saying? Checking the nigga temperature cause everywhere you turn, you don't know where it's coming from, you hear me? We gonna take you to a spot that's not hella on the open type shit. Nah, 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 we good right here. It's just, it's wherever we go, you know what I'm saying? It's gonna be like that, that's the city for you. You get what I'm saying? You never know who's spending that bin, who in them cars, who behind them five cent tents and shit. You just gotta be ready for that shit. You hear me? Somebody always wanna get in the way when you following somebody. Welcome to Watts, man. That's where the street ball league at. You hear me? Last shit went down on this on this one street. You hear me? First wreck used to be right there. You know what I'm saying? A lot of history at that wreck. <coughs> through that wreck, a lot of you know what I'm saying. Shit went down to that wreck. We got the Watts league right here. This with Kevin Durant that came down, dropped his nuts at. Huh? Be hooping too? Yeah, I used to be hooping, man. I done been in them jumps too, man. You understand? Know Drop my nuts a little bit. Who's that? You know what I'm saying? Nice to meet We good, we good, we good. <laughs> <laughs> what's up, man? You know what's going on, though. I feel that, I, I feel that. I, I told him he had to be on point, bro. Yeah, yeah, you don't know yeah, what's yeah, what. Yeah. I forgot already, to put you. Already be on it. Oh, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yeah, nah, for shit, show. For shit, show. Around here, man, we used to have an old wreck right here, man. Youngest motherfucker. We used to be flash, but when we look at our pictures, we was dirty as muff. Uh, like we was still having a little cut with ours. You just know, you know, shit just got a little better than what it was. Get that right there, man. Let them know, though. When I say when we in the city, you really got to play them birds. Got to play them birds, man. I see that motherfucking see? camera on there, on that yeah. Honda Coupe. Yeah. Got them cameras on them for medicine. Got to stay medicine. This shit the same as very well. It's just like we on hustling a little more. All that other shit around the city, we ain't. We, we gonna hustle more than everything else. Yeah, ain't too many niggas our age really want what we on. We ain't on that young dumb shit. We get on that though. Yeah, it'd be a, a situation where you not even on no bullshit. But a nigga try to play with you or something. Yeah, you and it's it. like you can't let a nigga play with you. And now it's like okay, now it's tried to be cool, but now you know what I'm saying. Your respect as a man. You know what I'm saying. Nigga can't nigga can't play with your respect as a man. That's def that's defamation of character. Yeah, and niggas be getting shit fucked up. They be they be grown ass. Men out here still on kid time, you hear me? And they don't understand what man time really is, you hear me? So that's where the, that's where it get fucked up at, you hear me? Niggas are niggas old as shit. Niggas older than us. Still be on kid little games. It's like some shit just lost, some shit ain't lost. You get what I'm saying? And as a man, you supposed to know shit 
like that. You hear me? If you don't know shit like that, then you just out here. If you're in the streets, you out here moving loose. You hear me? You too loose. You know what I'm saying? You're a liability to yourself out here, to your family, to your people. You hear me? Can't be like that. God move like a man. You hear me? Men respect men. That's law. You might come out of your house, you'll just see a car come past, hit the speed bump crazy, and a thousand one police cars chasing that motherfucker. You're like, what Wait, the fuck going on? All on your bumper, you hear like, me? What the fuck going on? I'm yeah. telling you. You might um, come out of your motherfucking house right here, a nigga might be standing over the top of a nigga, nah, you hear me? Real, Knocking his face. noodle off. Nah, for Jeez. real, though. I'm telling you. It ain't yeah. been there. It I'm been telling you. There. You might see him. You might come out of the house, see him all in hand, because he done served the undercover. <laughs> you feel what I'm saying? Ain't yeah, hey, that's right in the month. I'm telling you. He done did that about three, four times. He he was losing it. Yeah, you. <laughs> or you might catch his ass out here. Slump. I'm telling you. Touching slump. earth. You know what I'm saying? Sleep on the concrete. You, know, regular you said y'all did that once. What happened when you had good, uh... I've been out here 52 years. I remember about five, about five. The swing used to be right there where that tree was at. That, that, that tree right there. I fell out there motherfucking backwards and bust my face, but... Right here through this, uh, through the field, ain't, ain't, ain't nothing but, uh, like a little nursery where you grow gross. I left here and did like about 22 years. That's what actually saved me, cause, uh, I went from 87 to like 05 and I was jail. You know, but it kept me alive, it matured me. I, I'm, I'm just totally different. You know, I do the same shit, but I just got a little finesse with it. Tell them about that jug jug, oh, man. I found 70,000 geek in one night. No in the kizzy. House. Nigga, we in the abandoned house found 70 bands. We ain't seen them for a year. <laughs> <laughs> we ain't seen them for a year. He come back out. What he do, Ray Bull? Oh, oh, yeah. he came over that money. I'm telling you. He was gone for a year. Nah, man. for real. No, where the fuck he got that money at? Gown. That's a come up. That was a hell of a come up. Only, only a nigga like him could get, you hear me? All the crap game, big crap games went on down here, you hear me? Come down here, lose your bag, lose your money, lose your rent. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We got oh. big shooters. I don't be shooting dice. It's too, it's too many variables with it. Nigga feel like you ain't hit your point. You feel like you hit and it just, you know? Y'all yeah. Instagram? All it take off too, man. I'm saying that happened, my man, man. You got to read these niggas y'all playing with, man. You got to really understand who you gambling your life with. Understand that. Is it really worth it? You get what I'm saying? A nigga, a nigga like me. really try to take you out for a female. A nigga like me, I was really lost in a couple crap games, Wiz, though. I'm coming to the crap games with a with a bag. You understand? Y'all like a little bag. And I'm gambling with niggas that ain't got half or not even nothing close to what I got. I be losing my money. The niggas that ain't even Mr. Do Right with the money, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's smart, crazy. think smarter, not harder. You gotta read the room, man. Shit, you know what I'm saying? You be gambling with a bunch of wolves, you hear me? Wolves that can't afford to lose that money they losing, you know what I'm saying? And it just be your night, you know what I'm saying? That's why you only supposed to really. I feel like you niggas only should shoot dice with they niggas type shit. Even if you lose it, they still in the same camp. Yeah. And the nigga not gonna. Well, you would expect some of your niggas not to do nothing too crazy yeah, too. That's what it is, them expectations, man. You be expecting a nigga not to uh 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 because it's all love. We around good men, good genuine vibes. But then, like I said, you never know what a nigga got going on that you just can't see. You know what I'm saying? A nigga might have woke up that day and he already done lost the rent. His girl cussing him out, this, that, and the third. He can't see his kids, woo, woo, woo. And he scraped up a couple little dollars. He feel like he about to get somewhere and he comes to the crap game, lose all that money. Oh. Sh me? <laughs> Let me get that, you know what I'm saying? That's how it be, it just be the, being a product of your environment, you hear me? No, you gotta make fact. best of what you come from, you hear me? Tell them, mom, we, we hustle for this yeah. shit. You know what I'm saying? We beat that curb for this shit. Ain't no scamming, no, no, none of that going on. The curb know us personally, you feel me? Know us personally, that's why we stand on motion, you hear me? Heavy rotation, if you ain't having no motion, you're joking. Nah, this is where we grew up at right here, coming nah. down here. This is where we learn how to shoot yeah. dice at. Probably, I ain't gonna lie, that's where I seen my first body at. You hear me? It was a, it was a nice little crap game out here that day. Man, it was a nice crap game. I ain't gonna lie, I was a youngin'. So I had probably like, I wanna say I started the day with probably like $50, you hear me? Hit the crap game, ran it up probably like 150, you hear me? Crap game just getting heavier and heavier. Next thing you know, the crap game at a hundred, a hundred a shot, you hear me? An old head nigga, I don't know where he from, he came down, he swiped the crap game, you know what I'm saying? And nigga ended up walking up the street, got his ass punished, I don't, you know what I'm saying? When you say when you say swiping like he robbed him, no, nah, or he like he just him. beat he everybody. Man, I think I think that nigga had like one hand or something like that. I think he had like. I one. thought he was playing with fake counties. 
shot. Man, that nigga yeah, had a hell shot. of a shot. I lied to you not, bro. I had hundred fifty dollars by the time I, I I faded this nigga. Mind you, they had they got more for a hundred a shot. But when I get on the dice, I'm like, look, I don't, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to go fifty. Man, the nigga shoot the dice. If you know ten, this nigga shot the ten. I'm talking about those four shots, bro. He took my one fifty and four shots. But this ain't. This, I'm talking about the whole crap game was just like this. I'm talking about he ain't had no other shot. It was just like a ten and a ten. I right, picked up my money. A 10 and then a 10. I'm like, oh, no, nah, this nigga got to be cheating. I was broke. You hear me? I was mad as shit. Next thing you know, probably like two hours later. Not even two hours. Probably like an hour later because he was swiping everybody. We just watching the game. We chilling. Next thing you know, go, 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 go. Everybody, oh, what's going on? You hear me? Oh, oh, man, slumped on the ground, man. You hear me? You think it was more on some hate shit? I'm more on some cheat. He thought they thought he was cheating. Man, if you know how crap games go, you know how crap games go. It just be how it be. You know what I'm saying? It was just a nigga day. It was just a nigga day, man. We grew up in this shit. We grew up in it. My mother so dope. My father so dope. You get what I'm saying? It's just like, it's just the way of life. You get what I'm saying? We grew up in these situations. You grow up, you trying to be who you trying to be. And you need that money on to be who you trying to be. You know what I'm saying? So when you start to realize, damn, my dukes ain't got that money. Pops ain't got that money. What you gonna do? You gonna go out here, you gonna gamble. You gonna go out here, you gonna hustle. You gonna try shit. You gonna try and make it make sense. You hear me? That's just the way of being a product of your environment. You hear me? But it's people who make the best out of being a product of your environment. That's where it makes sense. At, you get what I'm saying? You can't be stuck as a product of your environment. You can always be a product of your environment, but you got what kind of product of your environment you gonna be? Yeah, I just started maneuvering around through this jump. I was getting, I probably got jumped out here probably like, I can't even count. I got jumped a number of times, you hear me? Been real, I like off the backboard as soon as I got out here, you hear me? I had to tighten it straight up, you hear me? The people that jumped you, so I'm guessing they probably your friends now, huh? Nah, the niggas that jump me, I ain't. The niggas that I hang with right now, I ain't never get jumped by. I did have some like friends that ended up, you know what I'm saying, turning on me or some, some niggas that I had altercations with, I got ended up getting cool with, you hear me? It do be ending up like that, but nah, that ain't the case. The niggas I'm hanging with now, we been man, sh been by understood, you hear me? I ain't fuck with you niggas, but stay over there. My chips got on face down with tyranny, cuss me out again. That's crazy, cuz. So, so, when niggas. Miser. What's up, bro? Miser. Who told you that? Soldier, ready, soldier. Rotation going on, they know the f going on. Hey, got that door swing. Them niggas spots ain't like, oh, here yeah, y'all. Look at the refrigerator, look at the refrigerator. This shit. I mean, we done made a little something, but they don't hurt. We, man, we try, we try. Every other thing, you know what I'm saying? We make it make sense, man. We Cowboys fans, uh, this motherfucker. Niners, we finna torch them niggas. We finna torch them niggas today. What's up with this guy? I'm on with him, I'm fucking. He, he, he like, he like the wash. What's up, Rob? Mike's here all him. day. What's up, Rob? He's on the book. Who? You know, young Mochi gave me all this shit. Yeah, you know. That's what I'm doing. Yeah, stay tuned. Right here, MG Migo, you know. I be rapping too. They know I be on this real candy in this bitch. No bye bye. Real candy. Real candy. Yeah, me no bye bye. Go follow me. I tell you, 2500, you you get a bag, yeah. Me? And we moking candy. Don't get it fucked up. It's candy going on. Tell them backpack boys, they, you know what I'm saying? We gonna have to make it make sense for a motion pack, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Make it make sense, you hear me? Because we have a heavy rotation. We the ones really pushing, you know what I'm saying? Really pushing, making that make sense. So go ahead, tap in with us. 